All right, let's get this going. Put that there. See what I want. There we go. We have got our glowstone seeds. Hello and welcome to another episode of Regrowth Reloaded. Okay, we're starting off down here where we were last time. Um, I did kind of uh, rearrange the area just a little bit. I moved uh, everything over by two blocks just so that I could get to this um, uh, drawer here. Uh, you can see right now we have 28,000 essence in that drawer. So this thing is working really good. Um, I also, you can see I kind of extended out the area here too for our um, essence. And what do we have in here? We have 14,000 essence in here. Um, it's essentially the same process with the, the drum of the wild being set off by our redstone, uh, I'm sorry, our, our pulse mana spreader. Um, it drops the stuff and it gets picked up and put in here. Now I don't have it automated to create the actual um, essences, weak, uh, normal, and strong, um, just because it's easy enough to do by hand and I don't need tons and tons of that. And uh, we'll just let it go ahead and collect in here. Now I did um, move this over as well. Let's come up here real quick. So if you remember, it was right next to this one. The problem was is um, this hopper hawk was picking up some of our essence dust here. And, uh, and the same with this one was picking up some of our coal. Um, and it was just, I kind of wanted to get it all. So I figured let's go ahead and move it over. And so we got a little area here in the middle we could do something else with, but yeah, it just, so that so that we're only picking up what we need for in these hopper hawks and coming into these chests or into these drawers i should say so i want to do a couple of things today um first thing i did not show you how to do this in the last episode and i should have and that's how to get the quartz that we used for making our uh, comparators so it's just five pieces of essence of nether in a pattern like that will give you four nether quartz uh, I don't have any room left in there so that's okay so next thing we're going to do let's go into our quest book I, there are two things that I want to do today and then we're going to do something else so we one quest with unclaimed rewards um, okay well we're going to, what is this reward thing here? And that is the bigger barrels. Okay, so we did that. We got our structural upgrade one, and then we made a storage upgrade two. Uh, for that as well, we get two more storage upgrades. And, um, well, we need the, the structural upgrade ones anyway, so let's go ahead and take those. Alright, let me get this stuff out of the way. Let's go back into our book. Now, is that all of our quests that are completed? Yes. Okay, so we're going to go into Chapter 7, What the World is Built From. And we've got our uh, strong essence here. And let's go ahead and we're going to come over to this one here, Glowstone Seeds. Uh, yeah, we've, we've read this. The bioluminescent crystal in the nether seems like a good candidate for growing. So we're going to make glowstone seeds. So let's go ahead and take a look at our recipe there. So we've got an odor of purity, a torch, yellow dye, a rune of mana, four strong essence, and essence seed. So I've got that over here. So let me go ahead and make some room here. So we got our four strong essence, our odor of purity, yellow dye, a torch, rune of mana, 
and our essence seeds. Uh, let's come around here and we'll go ahead and get these on here. Get that started. Grab my wand and some living rock. And this will take a moment. I will be right back with you as soon as it's ready. All right, let's get this going. Put that there. See what I want. There we go. We have got our glowstone seeds. Let's go ahead and put these up here and out of the way. And we'll come into our book. And we will claim our reward. We're going to take the strong essence. There we go. And then the next one we're going to do is going to be lapis lazuli seeds. And it says, lapis lazuli both looks nice and is an exotic dye and were coveted by many. Might be you'll even find other uses for it. Okay, so let's uh, come in here. Let's take a look at the recipe. We have a reek of misfortune, dye seeds, some blue dye, rune of mana, four strong essence and essence seeds. So let's come in here and you get this stuff out of the way. So we have our four strong essence, Reek of Misfortune, Blue Dye, Dye Seeds, Rune of Mana, and Essence Seeds. Let's get these on our altar. wand out and get our living rock. Come on. All right, and I'll be right back with you as soon as this is ready to go. All right, let's do this. There we go. And I ran backwards, instead of forwards. There we go. So now we have our lapis lazuli seeds. So let me go ahead and collect our reward on that. Again, we're going to take the strong essence. All right. Uh, let me uh, put this away. There we go. There's our that. Let's run over here and let's put away our strong essence in here. Not go in there. There we go. Put away these other things. All right, so we got our upgrades. I'll go ahead and toss that nether quartz in there for now. I don't need it. All right. I'm going to run upstairs. And I'll be right back with you. All right. So. Um, let's go ahead and get these seeds scanned real quick. So we got our lapis. And that is 111. The glowstone will also be 111, but let's go ahead and get it scanned. Can I set up my area over here? I did not. So let me go ahead and grab some crop sticks. those down there and there. Let's go ahead and get these planted real quick. Lay out my crop sticks. There we go. All right, we'll let that grow out. Put this stuff away. All right, so what I want to do today is I want to actually build us a house. We've been sleeping outdoors for 
you know, what, what are we on now? This is episode 22, so yeah, quite a while now. Um, so it's time to build this house. Since we cleared out um, the uh, Batania stuff, took it downstairs, we've got all this area here, and I thought we'd build ourselves kind of like a farmhouse in this area. Now what I want to make it from is um, I've got this red rock, um, which I've crafted from Essence of Fire and Essence of Earth, and then those can be crafted into red bricks. I kind of like the looks of these bricks a lot better than, you know, the clay bricks. I just think those clay bricks are kind of ugly. So let me show you how to make the red rock real quick. It's just, I, if I recall correctly, it's like this, and then like that. No, it's the opposite direction. this there we go and that'll give you 32 red rock and then you make your bricks out of it just by doing that and there you go so I've got uh, five stacks of the bricks I've got four stacks of regular rock I've got some stone I've got dirt for my scaffolding and then I'm gonna do the roof and probably the floors in oak and some trimming in spruce so as you may notice here on my um, my uh, J or my uh, <laughs> map up in the corner, you see Desert Rat Cam. Let me go ahead and uh, jump into Journey Map here. And you can see it right there. I do have a camera account on right now, um, and he's hiding over in our hidey hole. And I've added two new mods to this um, mod pack. To help us out here, one of them is called um, um, Mine Cam. So that allows you to place invisible cameras in a couple of places, and we're use, going to be using that to try to record a time lapse. The other one I added was Morpheus, which is a mod that allows one player sleeping. Without it, I wouldn't be able to sleep at all because I'd have to go over and, and make the camera account sleep as well. Now, unfortunately, this is 1.7.10, and uh, we don't have spectator mode in this. It didn't come until 1.8. So, let me go ahead. I'm going to get my uh, camera account started here recording, and then we're going to just start building, and I'm going to do try to do a third-person time lapse. So, here we go. Thank you. 
All right, we got the uh, basic outline of our house done. I put up the walls, I put a roof on it. I might want to, um, you know, tweak it a little bit here and there um, going forward, but. Uh, I think this will do. I, I do need to finish up the inside. I need to put in some flooring downstairs. It is kind of narrow, but that's okay. Um, we do have a second floor here, and there's actually a bit of, of an attic space up above, which I need to um, fill in and get lit up so that things don't spawn up there. So let's go ahead and uh, do that real quick. Let me see. Do I have any... Oakwood left. I've got a bunch of stairs. Let me go grab some oak wood from over here. And I'll grab a stack of it, that's fine. Go ahead and make some planks. Okay, good. Let me see. I think I want to make Let's see, do I have any ladders left in here? I've got two. Go ahead and grab those. Let's go ahead and make some uh, sticks out of this. I don't need that many ladders, but you know, we'll use them eventually. Go ahead and put those away. I wanna make some trap doors. Two of them. I want a few more than that. Um, let me just go ahead and do that. Okay. Come back in here. And uh, actually, yeah, it's going to have to be here. So that means I'm going to have to take that window out and I need some more of the bricks and let's go ahead and put those in there and we got our stairs or ladders here, 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 and then we need the trapdoor up there. We should be able to. Nope. Get the trapdoor on. I think it needs to go on. This side. There we go. And then just around here, I want to take our oak wood and let's just kind of fill in these areas here. I guess we could put chests or something in there, but we're gonna be doing a much better storage room here very soon, hopefully. All right, so we got that. Let's go ahead and put some torches up. I got a couple of them. One there, one there. Let's see, you can put one here, here, and let's see, about in the center. I think that's yeah, it should be good. All right, that'll light this area up. Uh, we need that. Uh, I guess I can't put one there for some reason. All right. So that takes care of that. Now let's do a floor down here. And I think I'm just going to do oak wood. Mm, 
I'll probably use whole blocks here instead of uh, plant or slabs. All right. Let's go ahead and pick up the dirt here. Okay, that's that. Let's see what this looks like now. I want to put one here. It's going to knock my door out. Let's go ahead and put the door back. There. There we go. Let's make some torches. Okay, I know I've got there's one stick. I don't know where all those sticks at. Add more than one. Did I use them all on those ladders? I must have. Alright, we'll go ahead and make a few more here. We don't need a ton. Alright, let's go ahead and make our torches. Now what I want to do here, so by the front door, put some torches up, but I'm going to actually use the chisel on the torches. And let's see, I need uh, like two of them. And these are the different designs that we get from uh, chiseling the torches. I think I'm going to use, let's see what this one looks like. And we can attach that there and there. That looks pretty cool. All right, uh, back to the trap doors. I was thinking about putting them. Can I attach them there? No. Okay, I guess I can't attach them underneath. Uh, that's all right. That's all right. That's all right. Um, okay, well, I think that's going to be it for the house. I might do a little bit more fixing this up that like that window looks funny I might extend it out by one that way this one doesn't look too bad so I will do those off camera and then I will start uh, moving some stuff in and then maybe in the next episode we will um, use some deco craft and um, do a few things there okay well I hope the um, time lapse turns out okay it's um going to be the first time i've used that um, um camera mod um with my cam account um unfortunately like i say you can't do uh, uh, spectator mode in 1.7 so i had to use a mod to do that um and it's kind of hard to uh looking at two different computers at the same time trying to get things um settled so until next time this is desert rat have a good one Goodbye.